Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be doing my kit lineup for fall. So in there I have September, October, and November and I have everything in this binder and I have it organized by month. So we have these like divider things with some color themed stickers and then I have these months in these uh, page protectors. So I'll just quickly go through to show you what I have already figured out, like the special events, and then the kits that I need to, or the weeks that I need to, kits for. So the first week in September is my best friend's bridal shower. So I have this kit, the January 22 mystery from Scribble Prince Co. with some matte bronze foil. September 5th, I need a kit for. September 12th, I need a kit. The following week is a friend's wedding, so I have this kit from Glam Planner, and I actually already used the sticker for another Franken kit, but this week I am using everything else, basically, from the kit. September 26th, I'll need a kit for, and then into October, October 3rd, October 10th, my best friend's wedding, so her bridal showers in September wedding is in October. Oh, and I forgot to mention that this is the always kit and then for halloween i'm kind of doing a franken kit i have all these random stickers from a bunch of different shops with halloween related items so that will be in or the week well actually this isn't the week of halloween this week is the week of halloween but because it's my birthday i'm using the january 21 mystery with a ton of foil so it's going to be yeah, that'll be in more detail later. But then there's November 7th, November 14th, and then the week of Thanksgiving, which I still need a kit for. So that leaves seven kits, three in September, two in October, and two in November. So currently how I'm storing my fall kits is in this big, massive binder. It's been slimming down a little bit because I've been getting some Simply Gilded albums to have my seasonal kits and foil and all that stuff in. But since I don't have a fall album yet, I all of my fall stickers are, or all my fall kits are in here. So I'm just going to take out the entire fall section that I have. And I'm also going to go through some of the Anytime stickers that I think might coordinate as well. Which this one is a no, no. Okay, so that is all of that. And then I also know I have a Disney kit. And this is like my Harry Potter Disney album. And I want to use this because I've had it forever. And I just want to get rid of it. So that leaves all of these kits. So one... <laughs> Sixteen kits for seven weeks. So lovely. So first, what I'm gonna do is separate it by shop because I don't want to have like a monopoly on a shop for each season. So I'm gonna quickly do that. Okay. So now I have piles with all the shops. So this is Glam Planner, Planner Kate, Creating and Co, Planner Pixie Co, Scribble Prints Co, Simply Gilded, and then Franken kits. So first, I'm gonna prioritize franken kits so um out of these these two are like really fall related like really the only time i'm ever going to use them is the fall so i'm going to prioritize those and just make a new pile over here and then these are kind of anytime um leaning more towards fall but just in case i'm going to set those aside as maybes this simply gilded one is also a maybe so i'm going to put that in the maybe pile the Scribble Prints Co. I really like, which is also going to be a maybe, uh, no, I'm going to put them in the priority pile. These three from Planner Pixie Co. I don't want to use all three. I think I'm only just going to pick one and I'm, I'm really feeling this one. This is Haunted. So I'm going to put that in the priority and these I'm not even going to put in the maybe. I'm just going to put in the no. Creating and Co. I'm going to put in the maybe since it's kind of any time. So that's going to be a maybe. I have these four planner cates, and this one is by far the oldest, so I'm definitely going to put this in the priority, and then 
because I have so many already, I'm just going to say no to these. And then these two, which this one, because it's already like a half kit, I'm going to put that in the priority. And then this one, ugh. I also, I think I'm also going to put this in the priority because honestly, I have no idea when else I would use it. I mean, technically it is an anytime kit, but I think the colors just lend more towards fall. So, and I know I'm not going to use it in the winter, spring or summer really. So I'm putting that in the priority pile. So in the priority pile, I have one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, I have seven. So let's see here though. Um, this one is the only one that is not like a leaning towards fall. Even though the colors do lean towards fall. I might, I don't know, because these, this one I've had for a while because it's a Franken kit and I just kind of want to get rid of it. So I think, ugh, but I really want to use this one though. Mm. I don't know. Okay, I'm going to think on that. But these other ones, the Game Night, this Franken kit, Game Night themed, Simply Guild and Created and Co. I'm okay putting in the no pile. And these two I will have to figure out between. Because this one I don't really see myself using in the winter, but this one I kind of do. So I may put this off and use this one instead. But I will think on it to see what weeks I need to fill and whatnot. So here is the fall binder again. So let's just go through and fill it in so september oh wait let me have this oh gosh have this available so in september i have three options so this one i think is definitely a september one this one is for sure a september one this one is october i think this one I also see as October this one this one I can see as November but this one I don't know if this is September or November because <clears throat> okay well first let me do this this one I'm okay with the first week of September so I'm just going to slide that in here. So then I have September 12th and then the 20th. So September 26th, I think I'm going to use this one. And then September 12th. I might honestly just use this and then use this in the winter. Let me open this up to see a little bit more what colors I chose. Because I kind of have this as like a lazy day theme kind of with these like past. Oh yeah, this I think at least this sheet would be good in January. But see these colors kind of lend more towards fall. But I think, oh this has been the Bridgerton kit or the Daphne kit. So I think, honestly, I can... Well, this isn't what this is. Yeah, no, I'm moving this to January. Done deal, so I could use that Scribble Prince Co. kit. Okay, so this one... Actually, I think this one I'm going to put September 5th because this one I think is a better, like, August-September transition. This one is, like, a true September kind of... Or both are really transitions, but... I want to use this one closer to August. The florals, the wedding, haunted. So October 3rd. So what do I have left? So October I also have two. So I think October 3rd I'm going to use this one, which is a Franken kit. It's kind of like a haunted hayride theme going on. October 10th, I'm going to use this villainous kit from Glam Planner, or what's left of it, really. Marissa's wedding, Halloween, my birthday. 
November 7th, I'm going to use this autumn nights kit which is the, the autumn nights sheet is really this only one this full box the only one that i have from that kit everything else is franken kit or like random sheets together and then the 14th i will use this glam planner cleopatra themed kit and then finally thanksgiving which i do not have a thanksgiving themed kit yet but that i will purchase later as the art comes out okay so that wasn't terrible actually okay so in summary for September, I have the January 22 Mystery Ultimate Kit from Scribble Prince Co. for my best friend's bridal shower. The oh, I'm using two Scribble Prince Co. mysteries back to back, but that's okay. The July 22 Mystery from Scribble Prince Co. Ultimate Kit for September 5th. The Planner Kate Mini Kit 171, and she doesn't have kit sizes. She her sheets are um, a la carte. So for September 12th. This is the Glam Planner kit, which I completely forgot. I think it's like Fall in Love or Fall in the Woods, something with like that for a friend's wedding. And this is her mini kit, and I have a couple add-ons in there. For September 26th, I have Haunted from Planner Pixie Co. October 3rd is a Franken kit with a Haunted Hay Rides theme. October 10th is Villainous from Glam Planner, and this is her Lux, well, what's left of the Lux kit with a bunch of add-ons and I also already have Gold Hollow from Planet Hannah. For my best friend's wedding, I'm using Always from School of Prince Co. in the, did I get the mini or the ultimate kit? The mini kit with a couple add-ons as well. For Halloween, I'm doing like a Franken spread with a bunch of random items. For the actual week of Halloween, which my birthday is the 5th, so for my birthday I'm using January 21 Mystery Ultimate Kit from Scroll Prince Co. With mixed metal foil from Planet Hannah and Scroll Prince Co. So a lot of SPC mysteries I'm realizing. <laughs> for the week of November 7th, I am using this Franken Kit from, well the full boxes are from SPC, it's called Autumn Nights. And then the week of November 14th, I am using this Lux kit I want to say from Glam Planner I believe it's called Cleopatra and then Thanksgiving is TBD so for now that is what I have planned again things can change depending on what kits I get and receive especially with mysteries in the future but for now that is my plan so thank you so much for watching I hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button and I'll see you next time have a great day Bye bye